Played here down this recent stretch uh, at the Scotiabank Saddledome and overall, but it's nothing in compare what a group of 40 men will take on the start of the hockey marathon for kids. They'll do it in support of the Alberta Children's Hospital Foundation. 40 men playing 261 consecutive hours of hockey in Chester here. Here's the dream and the. Hey, it's a 261 hour game, continuous hockey. Two teams have been training since August. Uh, once that puck drops, there's no changing size, there's no adding players. So the biggest thing now is getting through the game physically and not just. As soon as injuries start to come into play, you can be playing up to 18 hours. Unfortunately, cancer hasn't gone anywhere uh, over the years. It's actually gotten a worse uh, for, for children uh, over the course of the last few years. And with the way the world's been the last few years in terms of you know, COVID and people stuck at home, we wanted to be the last two or three years. We wanted to do something to give back. Kind of we're excited. Uh, we obviously we're getting older right now. We're 10 years older, uh, but we're still young at heart. And uh, getting back together with the hospital and, and meeting some of these children again, I'm going to put my body through you know, to help really move the world through another two or three years of treatment. Luke Cowan is one Aaron. Uh, we spoke to him Sunday, like I said, to the girls on the soccer game, had a Zoom meeting to meet the Ambassador family and meet the cause. And then Tuesday, they showed up and said, Yeah, we're going to do this. And then Wednesday, they showed up and said, Yeah, we're going to do this. And then Wednesday, they showed up and said, Yeah, we're going to do this. And then Wednesday, they showed up and said, Yeah, Tyler said, hey, um, you know, Lucas leukemia and Tyler connection for a home day, right? I mean, I've got three, three kind of driving or reflecting things I'm going to use. And we had a, a neighbor, Greta Mayofsky. She passed away from childhood cancer. She just lived up the street. We've got Luke. And then my wife working at the Children's Hospital. I mean, those three connections are going to be what I'm going to reflect back what I'm going to use to, to push me through the door. So some great insight is to why they're doing it. The Hockey Marathon for Kids, the puck drops on March 31st, 261 consecutive hours of hockey, all in hopes of raising some big money for 261 consecutive hours of how? Hell, hell. We respect everybody's choice. What the fuck do you mean in appropriate language? We don't really appreciate your support and understand. Together we can enjoy a safe and secure in our start to go, Brenda! Yeah. 